Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to It's All Knee. Today we are still in St. Louis and we are checking out the St. Louis Zoo, which is actually one of the few free zoos in the United States. As you can see, we're walking right in. Here we go. Wow, just like that. We are in. Yeah, free zoo. It's a look at this sticker. It's big too. This is the map of this place. Got a zoo map. Got a zoo map. What you got? Wow. Elephants, sun I bears. I thought that was a guinea pig. I got so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Painted dog, cheetah, hyena. Just about everything apes. you can imagine. Yeah. So we got River's Edge, Discovery Corner, Lakeside Crossing, The Wild, Historic Hill, Red Rocks. Now, another thing is there are shows that you can go to, but you have to pay for the shows. Something I think is very important to point out. When you drive up, you're looking for a place to park. They do have a parking lot here, but it does cost $15 to park. Normal vehicles, and if you have an oversized vehicle, it costs $30. So you come expecting not to pay anything. If you wanna park directly across the road from the, the zoo, it's gonna cost you money. But they do have along the street parking that is generally very busy. We were lucky enough to find a spot last second, and then you don't have to pay anything. So we're here completely without any investment whatsoever. So let's uh, jump into this by showing you this duck over here who looks so cute. River's Edge, we have elephants, hippos, cheetahs. It's gotta be a good place to hit up. The wild has grizzly bears, penguins, prairie dog, a red panda. Oh my Ooh. gosh, cute. And Red Rocks is big cat country. It has camels and zebras as well. Okay. We gotta hit up those places. All right, so where should we go first? Uh, River's Edge. All right, let's head to River's Edge. All right, let's do it. To River's Edge we go. Look at guys at home. This thing's massive, holy buckets. Yeah. My gosh. How do we go our side? Yeah. A lot of water. A lot of plant food. All right, so what do we have to expect here at River's Edge? We got elephants, elephantes. We got a hippo, a rhino. Ooh, capybara. Capybara. What'd you say, Gert? Oh yeah, cheetah, hyena. Is this a... Like a, maybe a meerkat or something? Groundhog. Groundhog? Yeah. Is this a wolverine? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, it looks like a bear. What is that? Um, I was gonna say hyena, but it's not. I recognize it, but I don't know what it is. I do too. Well, there's only one way to find out. That's right. What? This is nice. I like this. No fishies. Oh my goodness, well maybe that's why it's called the River's Edge, huh? I love all the plant Yeah, yeah. It's really cool because like you're in an area of the zoo and it feels separate. Mm -hmm. So far, yeah, it really like does. it's themed. It feels very themed. It's, they do such a great job of it. Yeah. Bears like to pace. Oh yeah, I know. He's right there. I want him to get in the water. Oh! Looks like he wasn't a little bit ago. He's pretty yeah. wet. He is. 
Right Oof, there's a there is a special scent over here. Oh boy. Oh my goodness gracious. Hello, black rhino. Are you in here, sir? Sacred abyss. And sacred abyss. I know. It's so bad. It's probably a, a rhino testicle right there. That's how big they are. Seriously. <laughs> I don't see it, but I can smell it. And I yeah, it. yeah, I can't see it, but I surely smell it as well. So far, we've seen one, one sleeping capybara, capybara, and capybara, and a black bear. Oh, and a squirrel. Yes, and a squirrel. Oh, yeah, and a spider web. Yeah, and a giant spider web. <laughs> Purina Painted Dog Reserve. Oh, there's one. I saw it. There's one straight through, Penny. Over there. There's another one over there too. Again, their little uh, areas are so cool looking. They are nice. A BC or whatever. Two little guys right there. But no black rhino, but I can see why we smell it because it's literally just this giant pile of dump back there it looks like huh. once it's mud I can't really tell either way she stank a little Lipman wallow red river hog he's right right there is he is he dead is he are you sure are you sure can you confirm <laughs> yeah, he is. He's breathing steady. He's just really passed out. Yeah, kind of looks like Pumbaa. <laughs> All right, we're headed to the Hippo Overlook. We have to be quiet, though. So be quiet. Luckily for Gert, there's no swimming here. All right. Do you think we'll see a hippo? We don't see a hippo. Yeah, I don't see a hippo. So much for being quiet. No hippo. Oh, there's fish though. Yeah, little, little fishers. But no hippos. No hippos. I guess we don't have to worry about being loud, huh? I guess not. All right. Well, moving on. Yeah, he does. His little foot right there. Man. Thick. Yes, it is. Wow. Yeah, there's the fish are giving them this. Okay, let's go to this other one. That is awesome. Mongoose right there. Cute little sucker. This is nearby the cheetah pen where we got cheated out of seeing a cheetah. There was no cheetah present. We're about to witness a moth murder down here. Oh, moth just, oh yeah, he's just swimming down there. You're right. Oh. I don't think there's any fish in there either though. So it wouldn't be a murder, it'd be a suicide. Or a accidental death. I think it's a bubbler, yeah. Just a classic bubbler. Okay. Look at that. Uh, I think it would rip you to shreds. Yeah. Stomp you to shreds. I want to see him get in the water. Yeah. And play. More elephants. There's one way over there. There's one there, and there's two there. Eating hay, like cows. They smell like cows and they eat like cows. Hi, cows. 
<laughs> it officially smells like a theme park. Well, no elephant, but it's a really... Oh, there he is! Wow! Oh, he's huge! Wow. Oh, come on, play in the waterfall. Please. Going for a drink, maybe. Yeah, he literally just got a huge glop, glop of it. Wow, that was amazing. Wow, that's crazy. The control he has with his trunk is nuts. Up the scraps on the ground, yeah. some on his back. My goodness. I mean, I knew the trunks were. Yeah, that's insane. That Literally just. Yeah. Wow, that's nuts. Seriously, you could thread a needle with that. Mm hmm. Hey, Dad. 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 Oh, these things are in the Mississippi. Long nose gar. Long nose gar and a big head carp. Wow. All right, that was River's Edge, everybody. Oh, a cardinal. Golden silk spider. Here you go, mom. Look at how big that web is. Oh, we got more. We got more tarantulas. Look at the webbing in here. All right, where's he hiding? Ah. She's there. Oh my gosh. Ew, it's little eyes. Yeah. Wow. I want to see it move. Oh, yeah. Look at this bug. Oh my goodness. It's just gigantic. And cicadas. I hear my wife talking about being scared. What'd you find? Look at nasty, massive bugs. Oh my gosh. Stick insects. No. They're huge. Oh my gosh, the one in the back. Ew, they're thick legs. That one's the thickest one, I think. Oh my goodness. There's a whole bunch back there up here. Oh my goodness. Jess, try to zoom up right back there. Holy moly. Lay there flat like that. That's gross. Yeah, that's nasty, dude. Apparently, the males secrete a foul odor to warn off predators. All right, we're in the butterfly dome now. Seth, you wouldn't like it in here, bro.
Maybe they'll land on us like they did last time. Uh -huh. so if you want a butterfly to land on you, yeah. you need uh, bright clothing um, and a lot of perfume or aftershave. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. I have no, cologne on, so. I have a little perfume. Yeah, on this plan B, which is to get real hot and sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that flower. Oh, it's beautiful. Hello, everybody. Oh, there's a there's a monarch right there. Wow. Take a look. It's in a book. Reading rainbow. A big grizz. Yeah, wow. Another one over there in the water. You can't see. He blends in pretty well. He's right there. They look so cuddly, but they're so vicious. So cuddly. And got a, got a scratch. We got a homeless, we got a homeless orangutan right here on her blanket. And look at this king of the jungle. Oh back my there. goodness. He's huge. He's massive. Why is no one in here? This is amazing. We don't want him to come in here. He was eating a, an, an onion. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Do you... What? Is this the only place you can get away from the shade? Maybe you guys are scared of each other. <laughs> With a bowl on its head, just like Manly. Look at this onlooker right now. He's just enjoying the show. This one, yeah, both of them. They're all like, you guys hear oh, what's this going one on? Too. Mm -hmm. Here as well. What do you think about this, buddy? Yeah. All right, put the kids to bed. All right, so we found some lions. Actually, zoom up because I'm using my phone because my GoPro died. You can see them right in the middle of the screen there. Got a male and a female. Just chilling. You see a snow leopard in there? Oh, he's in his little den. Yeah, he's in there. Adult servals can jump up to 10 feet from sitting there. And there's the servo right there. A little spotted orange thing. It's relaxing. <laughs> yep. There he is. Way out there. Laying in the grass. Like everything else we've seen today. <laughs> Today's a very sleepy day at the zoo. It is hot, so that's probably why. Another sleepy head. Your whole video is just cat sleeping. Just literally just cat sleeping. Hi guys, wave. Don't get me wrong, it's a great zoo, especially because it's free, but not a whole lot of animals on the animal tour so far, except for the turtles and the elephants. And the butterflies. And the butterflies. 
<laughs> yeah, that one turtle that's keeping the endangered species from going truly extinct. I see camels. Camels. Look at that furry sucker. Look at these camels. Just a couple camels. Crazy things. Even St. Louis has cows. <laughs> I don't actually know what this is. There's a giant bull back there too. Montang. Montang have a keen sense of smell, which they use to find each other and detect enemies. Okay. Hello, Montang. 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 <laughs> Long time? They have a keen sense of smell, which they use to find each other and detect enemies. Long time. They're endangered. Oh, let's do that. Thank you for your service. We got the ostrich. We got Jeffrey the giraffe from Toys R Us. We got another guy over here. I'm going way out there. For being a free zoo, the complex is here. Really impressive. Very, very cool looking. Apparently giraffes can spot a moving person from a mile away. Wow. It's coming. Coming to join its buddy. Coming for food. I think that one might be coming. I'm to get real busy over here. <laughs> Good timing. They're all coming. The ostrich is just watching. He's like, why am I in here with these giant horse-like things? Yeah. Got some kangaroos. We got a joey far left. Mama's carrying a joey. Center screen. Oh yeah, you can see him. Another really cool thing at the zoo is this massive uh, monkey place. Yeah, and it's connected to a massive playground. So you can come look at the monkeys while jumping around like one in the playground. It's super cool, and it's actually pretty big. Like adults are able to walk through this as well, which is really cool. All right, kids, that wraps it up here for us at the St. Louis Zoo. Again, this zoo is free. We didn't see a ton of animals, but we saw a good handful. And the ones we did see really showed up and showed out, and it was a really, really good time. Definitely worth checking out if you're in the area. Because again, I mean, free, baby. You guys agree? Worth checking out, Tiny? Oh, for sure. Dan? Absolutely. 100%. Yeah, so again, $50 for parking across the way, $30 for an oversized vehicle, admission completely for free and stays open until 5 p.m. And right now they're actually doing something for Halloween, which is really cool. So definitely check it out here in the area. And as always, it is all me and no foot. And we will see you in the next one. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Video's not done yet, kids. Video's not done yet. Listen, listen. 
I just dropped a brand new It's All Knee merch. And I need to make sure you guys check out the description below for all the details. There's a link. Grab your merch. We got hoodies. We got t-shirts. We got tank tops. We got stickers. There's hats. All sorts of stuff. New designs are going to be coming throughout the upcoming months. So I want to make sure you guys check that out. It's All Knee merch. Available now. Don't miss it, kids. It's a great way to support me and my channel and upcoming content. So make sure you hit that description down below. Check out that comment section. Let me know what you'd like to see for future merch. Grab you some and let me know what you ordered. Okay, video's done. You can, you can move on. I'm gonna go back inside.